Getting started with Autodesk 3ds Max. Well, the simplest way to start Autodesk 3ds Max is just to double click on the icon, and you can see that's located right here. However, not every computer will have the icon on the desktop, but if you come down to the, um, the Start menu, down here, click in the Start menu, go to All Programs, then we're going to go to Autodesk. And under Autodesk, we're going to go to Autodesk 3ds Max. And under 3ds Max, we're going to pick our version of the language. I'm going to go with English. I'll click on this. This will work on every computer, no matter what its operating system is, etc. Um, so it's always there. Where the desktop icons are easier, they might not be on every setup. When you launch Autodesk 3ds Max, the first time will be a little slow. It's called the first first install. It has to set up a lot of parameters on your machine. So it takes a little time. The second time you launch it, it'll be quicker. Now, the first time you launch it, uh, it'll ask if you want to do the, the customer involvement program. And you can say yes or no and say OK. Um, it'll also ask you if you want to do any learning or starting. So down here we're in the start mode, over here we're in the learn mode. It may also ask you for your mouse settings. Um, in the mouse settings I go with the defaults uh, for those. Once you get this far uh, we are then able to really get started with uh, this and I'm going to say let's use a startup template alright so I'm going to pick a startup template we're going to typically use the original startup or default template and so I can click on this template so I'm double clicking and I can load up that particular template and so we have just got it started with Autodesk 3ds Max and we're into the program for our very first time.